question. Pam in Connecticut asks this. I fully understand how the Illuminati and other players in the realm of the dark are created by us to provide us contrast. Does the very same apply to visitors from other worlds who may have their own agenda in the future of planet Earth? Uh, uh, which Earth? Mm. Yeah, there's more than one Earth. Mm-hmm. You see, here's how it goes. Here's how it goes. Let's, let's flip this back to you, James, specifically. That way, if it's touchy, it won't be touchy for anyone but you. Right. If you think they're coming to get you, then they probably will. Okay? Because you're the creator. You allow it. So, mm-hmm. it doesn't matter what inside or outside of which kingdom you're embracing a thought or a concept regarding. As long as you're the king of your kingdom... It really doesn't matter what the Lemurians do. Okay, so then I think her follow-up is good. You want to read that, James? Yeah. Yeah. Are are we really immune to it all when we reclaim our power and become the gods we are? Or are there wild cards out there like beings with their own agenda? Well, 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 okay. Wild cards are nothing other than contrast that you haven't engaged yet. Wild cards are nothing but contrast that you have not yet engaged in your physical experience. Well, are we immune to it? Well, if you if you engage it, then just like you take your you take your you take your uh, vaccination and you introduce a bit of the nastiness and you build a tolerance regarding it, that's how you build immunity through the contrast of engaging it into your meat sack body. That's why we say drink sewage; it'll help you immensely. But you can re- 